What's up everybody, it's Infamous Ghost. Today we are just going to make a small tutorial how to jailbreak your PS Station 3 fat and slim uh, in official framework called 4.82. So first, I would like to excuse myself for English and American people because I'm Belgian, so my first language is, is French. So I'm just going to do my best. What you need, it's a USB stick formatted in FAT32, a PS3 and a laptop. Or computer so you can see I am already on official firmware phone 82 I don't have the install package file and the uh, HPP home I am already online so it's uh, a real official firmware as you can see I'm just going to show you my system settings just wait system information as you can see I'm really on a 4.82 I will just disconnect so uh, what you are going to do first, you just let it go and open the folder I gave you by the link in the description. It's totally, totally free without survey. You, you can download it secure. It's called Jailbreak PS3. First step you are going to launch is the the program PS3 Console Compatibility Gray. So you know this tutorial will only work for PS3 FAT and half of the slim, not super slim, okay? So as you can see, on the rear, on the rear uh, of your PS3, we've got this kind of code on the fat, on the slim. But uh, some slim, you have a date code. It will be asked for to determine the compatibility. So for me, I have got a PS3 fat, and I've got a C E C H G. So you just put C E C H G. Imagine you have a slim uh, C uh, C C E C H two thousand fifty and fifteen five hundred and four A. So if you so here you have to type the date code of your console. Once you have done it, just wait. Just click on start. This program will save you compatible or not compatible. Uh, and look if you have a non memory of an OR. If you have a n slim PS3, you have got an OR. If you have got an, a FAT, you ha half of the FAT have non and half of the FAT have NOR. So, you have to check two, f two things. Compatible on the minimal version. If you have a FAT, there isn't any problem. But if you have a slim, for example the first slim, are totally compatible because the minimal version are uh, under 3.55 but if you have the for example the new fa the old slim just before the super slim just wait it's totally not compatible because the minimal version is 3.63 so uh, as you can see I have got a nor a nor uh, a non sorry a non flash if you have a nor Later, you will have to go to the NOR page, and I have got a NAND, so I'm, I will go to the NAND page. So what you're going to do now is just put your USB stick into your computer. Uh, it must be in FAT32, uh, so I will show you. Just wait. As you can see, properties. I am... Just wait, my laptop will load it. As you can see, I am in FAT32. Now we are just going to minevert checker. We just copy the PS3 update.pup. Go to the folder PS3 update and just paste it. Then you just take the PS3 folder and paste it to the USB key. Just wait a few seconds. This can with this we are sure your PS3 can be downgraded and also can be jailbreak. So now we are just you put your USB stick into your PS3. You go, you go to uh, System Update, Update via Storage Media, and is, it will say Version Check Calcadon USB device. You just press OK. As you can see, Update Data Version 1.19 or later can be installed on the system. That will say if your update data version is under 3.55, you can jailbreak. Is it 3.60, you cannot and above. So now it's okay. We are just going again on the USB stick. 
uh, in the folder you take you open the rebug 4.82 just copy the update to the USB stick when it will appear I hope it will appear soon my USB stick I've got some problem sorry it's very embarrassing just wait yes so now you have copy the rebug 4.82 you go into the USB stick into the PS3 folder update and just pass it and replace Right now we are just copying the jailbreak update on the USB stick and now we are just going to make the very important part is in the PS3. So first you go to the internet browser. You will see it's very simple. You just press triangle tools home page and you choose use blank page and make OK. Now close the browser and you launch it again just wait as you can see we have got a blank page right now you just press tools delete cookies you tell yes and then tools delete cache once it's done you just press start and you will type www es3exploit.com like this and you press start then you go to flash writer write flash from HDD right here and if you have a NOND you go to NOND if you have a NOR you go to NOR it's exactly the same step but just click NOND or NOR I have got a NOND PS3 so I click on NOND it will say congratulations, we've detected your PS3 is running firmware 4.82 which is compatible uh, with PS2 exploit. Enjoy, you say just OK. I'm just making a little pause because <laughs> I have to go to the toilet, just wait a few seconds. OK, right, I'm here so you just needed to go to the toilet. So right now we are you have this page PS3 non flasher version 0.0 HDD edition or PS3 no flasher if you have uh, a NOR. So you are just going to scroll down on this blue link and press triangle file save target and just stay system storage photo you just press X it will just down download it's very simple and just wait okay download complete right now we just click on initialize exploitation and we just have to wait a few minutes it could be very quick it could be uh, very slow just like this you can see exploit initialization progress 10 percent just have to wait it can take a while it can be very quick it's depend on uh, the how to how your ps3 is motivate to work <laughs> so if it doesn't work we just have to refresh the page and do it again that's not a problem Yes, as you can see, initiation succeed, process to proceed to step three. If you have initially exploit initiation failed, just try triangle, refresh and do it again. Now we just click page non flash memory. If you have got a NOR, click on page NOR flash memory. Just click. Proceeding to patch. Okay, now it's done. It's complete. We just exit the browser. Put our USB stick into your PS3, the uh, USB slot, uh, right slot, the, the right one if preferred, but this, the left one works also. Now we are just going to turn off your si our system. It's very simple. Huh? We just turn off our system. And then we just wait 10 seconds to the flash uplink. The file is be, will be upright. Now we just boot OPS3. We just start up OPS3. As you can see, I'm just 
uh, recording my PS3 to show you it's really a PS3 fat, it's not a fake. You can see we are just every you are we are always on the official firmware, but now for PS3 new or none or no memory is flash, and we allow you to uh, install the the uh, jailbreak. So now we go to system updates, update via storage media. As you can see, we will it's Reberg 4.82.1 Reberg Rex. Just press OK. Just now we just have to wait. We accept the ending license agreement. Yes. Just press start. If at 79% it says file data corrupt, you just have to reboot your PS3 and do the flash again on the PS3 exploit page. Sometimes it might work, sometimes not. It depends of the your internet connection of uh, something else. Just wait. Just have to wait. I hope it's it's going to work. Just please, seventy nine percent. Don't say error, please. Don't. Yes, it's done. Right now, we are going to be in Reberg four point eighty two point one Rex edition. So it's practically done. Just wait. As you can see, checking for update data. Please wait. We are just going to wait. Please found or update. Yes, let's go. Installing the data system. So now we just have to wait a few minutes. So I will just mute my mic and uh, doing something else. I don't. I won't speed up the video because. I don't want you to s to think it's a fake, so I will just go. I just put my headset off and uh, wait a uh, few minutes.
Okay, guys, so now we are just on 72%. Just wait a bit. We are. It's well done. In a few minutes, and I think in 20 minutes, we will be jailbroken. So, if you want, you can take plug out the USB stick and put it into your laptop. In the folder, I gave you um, another folder, it's called package. If you want, you can copy it to your PS3, uh, to your USB stick, sorry. Mm, just wait for my USB stick being detected every time. Just fucking, <laughs> fucking USB stick. Yes, right now, you just take the package and copy to your USB stick. Three elements. It's just perfect synchronization. So now you can put again your USB stick into the PS3 USB slot. And right now, on se f uh, s 16 minutes, we are in Reburg. It's really gel we just jailbroken, jailbreak or PS3. As you can see, oh, my computer seems to have a, a bit of problem. I'm just going to. Seen my seen out myself. I don't want to be banned from the PSN. Just wait. Stupid it. Stupid control. Yes. Just seen out. As you can see, just wait. Little store review. PS PlayStation Network in red, like this. Uh, we have the APP Home PS3 game package manager. Right now, you go into the package manager, install package file, PS3 system storage have got the oh, the rework toolbox once it's done just launch it and you will see we are really in jailbreak you know we are in jailbreak but I will show you as you can see oh, we are just languages I am French so I will put the rework toolbox in French but it won't change anything just wait a while, it will reboot. Yes, the PS3 is rebooting. Just wait. And as you can see on system information, you will see CEX, CEX. If you want to flash your PS3 index, I've, I've made some tutorial, it's just very simple. You just have to click save the ID root key. Once it's done, you just click on rewrite target ID in flash, reboot and then swap the LV2 kernel. It's very simple. So right now we are just going to install the, the two PKGs I have gave you. They are very use, uh, useful. The first is here you go into package manager, install package file, package directory. You have control fan utility 4.82 and ulti oops, go again and you have Multiman 4.82. Uh, Multi One is the best homebrew ever made on PS3. You you can copy file, uh, use an, copy an uh, a boot a Spirix file, a uh, game launch pirated game, and the control fan utility is just a uh, homebrew which allow you to control your fan speed because jailbroken PS3 are more powerful than official firmware, so you take. Oof, as you can see, the <laughs> fans, my C PS3 is very, very hot. Just click to square to the current mode, it's play load, and then you just press, press triangle to exit. Every time you launch your PS3, every day, you just launch the control file utility and do it and do the play load mode. So I hope I help you I help you a lot. You can subscribe to my channel, leave a comment and why not follow me on Facebook. My my, my Facebook page it's called Infamous. Uh, and uh, just like I hope you will like like the video, share it and don't hesitate to subscribe and comment. Ciao, ciao bye bye.